Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be doing a try-on haul today. All the outfits are from Hot Miami Styles. They are all fall feels, so I'm excited to show you guys what I picked from HotMiamiStyles.com. If you guys do like this video, be sure to thumbs it up and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm interested to see if you guys like these type of videos. If you do, I will do more like them. Um, so this is my first like try on kind of deal. Or no, not really. This is my first, this is actually technically my second kind of haul-ish. If you guys like these kind of try on hauls where I'm talking about the fabric and like the feel of the dress and everything like that, totally let me know. If you guys like more lookbook kind of deals, let me know below as well. But yeah, today's just a try on haul, so I'm just gonna try on a couple outfits that I picked out from Hot Miami Styles, and yeah, let me know if you guys like them. I love to hear your thoughts and stuff, and that's about it. So the first dress I actually have on right now, and I paired it with a gold metal belt, because that's actually how I saw it being worn on the model on the website. It's a very autumn color. I really, really like it. It reminds me of Thanksgiving, all that kind of stuff. Um, I really love the color. I love the feel of it. It's very, very clingy to your body. So if you don't like clothes that are going to really sculpt your shape, I wouldn't recommend it. But I love clothes like that. So it fits me really, really nice. Gotta wear the spanks underneath because, you know, gotta make sure we're nice and smooth. But besides that, I really, really like it. And I like that it has like these little rips at the bottom too. It gives it some character has little rips on the sleeves as well. Really cute, very comfortable, very warm actually. So if you're like going out in the city or going out, if you are in a winter state and you're going out, this is actually really cute. I would pair it with some tights or maybe some booties. You can wear it with no tights as well, but um, depends I guess on how cold it would be. And I feel like adding a belt to a dress like this always helps give you shape, so. Yeah, so that is outfit number one. Super cute, super fall festive. And yeah, let me know what you guys think. So this is the next outfit. It is a nude see-through kind of skirt here, but it's got like a nude lining, so it's not like totally see-through. But it's got like that, like Kim, I think it's like almost very similar to what Kim Kardashian wore. I'm trying to think what war show it was, but I feel like you guys know what I'm talking about when she had the wet hair look. So I really, really like the skirt, so I wanted to try it, and I actually paired it with this rhinestone kind of see-through bodysuit. And I put a lace bra underneath just to kind of give it a little texture. <laughs> Not like the rhinestones give it enough texture, but I think it's super cute. It adds a little bit of a sultry, sexy look to this outfit. Um, I would probably wear this with like some heels or some booties or something like that. That would be really, really cute. But I love how this would be like perfect for New Year's or something like that. I feel like anything with a little glitter, if you're not like too crazy about glitter or anything or sequins or anything like that, this is like a pretty simple-ish top, I would say. Um, and you can like add, jazz it up with whatever kind of lingerie or bra underneath. And I really think that's kind of cute. So that is that. There is like a little tie here. I'm not sure. Oh, I think it's like, oh, it does that. Okay, so it like brings everything to, it bunches it a little bit more. So I'm not sure if you're supposed to like tuck this under. I'd probably say so, but I'm not positive. So I will probably look into that. But um, yeah, it'd be really cute with some booties. I feel like it always, I love clothes that make the butt look really, really nice. And this does that for me. Um, and yeah, it's just pretty comfortable too. I have to say, but I like the see-through kind of trend recently, like the see-through bodysuits and like just like the new on the bottom. I just like really think it's really cute and sexy and uh, really fun for like a New Year's party or a holiday party, something like that. And let me know your thoughts on this outfit. But yeah, last dress I chose is this really pretty suede number. Really, really cute for the winter and fall months. It's very, very body hugging, very, very nice and shaping to the body, the booty, boobs. I'm actually not wearing a bra right now, so um, it actually holds the boobs up pretty nice. Um, I have it zipped up as much as I can because I can't really reach, of course, but it is very, very cute. 
And I actually have a dress like this in pink that I really like. So I actually saw this and I love the detailing by the chest here. I love that. I feel like wearing like a nice dangly necklace like something like this. I think wearing a little bit of a delicate necklace like this would be really, really cute with it. Um, I'd probably wear some nice stilettos or something with these. You could even wear like really cute boots with it too. But I really do like it. I like the way it fits. It feels fits really, really comfortable. I feel like I would probably either wear this for Christmas or New Year's. Like this is just like a super sexy dress and I would have to wear it out somewhere. Here is the next outfit. Very, very sexual here. But it's actually very cute and very comfortable, believe it or not. Um, so this is like a spandex kind of material and these are kind of very giving, believe it or not. I actually have a similar pair that are more of a rope and they are not so giving. So these are actually a little bit more giving, a little bit more flexible. So this is super, super cute. Again, it really, really hugs your body. And it goes all the way down. So it's really, really cute. It would look really, really cute with like strappy sandals, maybe like a stiletto, like a thin strap. Paired it with this bodysuit that has like the matching gold detailing. So you don't really have to wear something like this. You could wear a crop top. Actually, it would look really, really cute. I saw the model wearing a crop top. I can actually put the picture over here if you guys want to see. Um, and it looks really, really cute. I feel like I'm a little bit. The midriff showing would be really cute, but um, for more of the colder months, I feel like this is a bit better, obviously, unless you're going to wear like a nice, actually, if you wore a bandeau and a nice, like, vest for fur vest, oh, this is definitely super sexy, but you guys can, like, tone it down with a shirt like this, but it's not, like, that bad, you know what I'm saying? Like, it goes up a little bit, but, like, it's not like you're showing a cooch or anything like that, so... I feel like it's very manageable. And uh, yeah. What do you guys think? Down below, what do you guys think of the fit? It is like pretty true to size, I have to say. Like I got this in a medium and I got these pants in a medium as well. So it fits pretty true to size. And I'm like pretty in the middle almost everywhere. So yeah. Next, here is the next outfit. Very jean, 70s chic, I feel like, but in a modern way. So you got these really cute jeans that I picked. The It doesn't match perfectly, but I actually don't mind that. So I'm actually not wearing a bra with this, and it's actually amazing. Um, usually I always have to find some kind of bra to work with these kind of uh, shirts, especially when they are not supportive of the boobs. So, but this is actually very supportive. I actually don't even have it zippered all the way, I don't think. And it's actually pretty supportive. And the fabric is thick enough where I don't have to worry about nipple showing or anything like that. So this is actually really, really cute. And I pair it with these jeans that are actually a little bit darker in color, which I don't mind because it's not sad that these don't perfectly match because I'm actually okay with it. I feel like it actually gives it a little bit more spunk that way. I feel like if it was so matchy-matchy, I wouldn't be feeling it that much. But um, it probably would be cute if it was like a two-piece. But I feel like if I wanted it to be a two-piece, I would want it to be like pants that would flow out too. You know what I'm saying? So these jeans actually have fishnet detailing. They're not real pockets here, but you do have pockets on the back end of your butt. And these fit really, really nicely. They're like the legging type of jeans where it's not like a real jean. Very comfortable. I really love this top. I feel like I could wear this top with a bunch of other things like with leggings or something like that, like high-waisted stuff. I can like raise this up and just show the midriff a little bit or you can just like kind of bring it down. You can pair this with anything. You can pair this with booties. You can wear a simple necklace like this or I feel like even a choker would look really cute. Um, but I love the detailing in the jeans. Even by the knees you have some fishnet detailing so that is really really cute um i probably wear these jeans like with t-shirts on the regular so and i like the way that they fit they fit like leggings which i like because i feel like sometimes jeans can make your body look a little bit weird at times depending on how they fit so i like i like jeans that fit like leggings because leggings fit my body pretty nicely so i feel like jeans that fit that way are a 10 out of 10 because I just rather have 
jeans for their leggings or jeans be like leggings because they're just way more comfortable. Is the next outfit that is again 70s chic with the shirt here and it's so comfortable. I love outfits like these. I actually have a lot of pants that like go out like this um, and they're so comfortable and I wear them with crop tops like this. Not as schnazzy as this one but you know something similar and I really really love the way this looks I feel like I can even get away with this for Halloween if I like wanted to be like a pirate or something sexual like that I feel like that would be really really cute so I'm actually not wearing a bra again with this because it actually holds me in pretty well I feel like if you tighten this pretty nicely you don't have to wear a bra it's a little bit bouncy but that's about it um but it's really, really, really cute. I actually would love for this for like summer. So I might actually save it for that, but I feel like it would be also a really cute Halloween costume. And I like the lines, of course. I feel like you kind of want your boobs to look bigger. So there's horizontal lines here. You want your arms to look longer. So there's vertical lines. And then you want your body to look longer here. So there's a vertical line. So I actually really, really like that. And for shoes, I feel like I'd probably wear just a regular black heel. Nothing too, too crazy. But again, it's super, super comfortable and I just love this. I wish they had more colors. This is just such a cute piece. And I think this is a medium as well, but um, really, really cute, really comfortable. I love comfortable. Comfortable is like my, it's just like the most important thing to me. Comfort is like really, really important to me. So I like that all these outfits have that. Them, so I had two other pieces that I had gotten I uh, had gotten these jeans here that are super cute but they actually ended up not fitting me yeah I got these in a size 7 so I got the other ones in a size 7 as well so I'm not sure if maybe they're just different makers of the jeans but um, so I'd probably be a 9 in cello if because I'm usually a 7 otherwise so yeah but these are really really cute I wish that they fit me but they don't which is fine what are you gonna do but I actually love that I don't, that, that most of the stuff that fit me, like I guess in size, and most of the stuff fits perfectly. So I was really, really excited about that. And then this is another shirt that I wanted to pair with those jeans. Um, and this fits actually really cute too. I guess I could try it on for you guys. If you guys are super interested, I guess I could try it on for you guys. But it's again, it's like those sleeves again here. And I wanted to pair it with those jeans. So I can actually pair it with those um, fishnet jeans. I actually would look, that would look really, really cute with. But again, this is just like another option you could wear. But this is another body. And it's a bodysuit too, which I really, really like. I love bodysuits. I just feel like they are very, very slimming. They're just a lot easier for girls that have bigger butts, I guess you would say. Girls are a little bit more curvy, like bodysuits, because it doesn't make them look so bunched up in the, sorry, it doesn't make them look so bunched up in the stomach area, so I actually really like the bodysuit way. So much better than t-shirts, unless like you literally are just like doing a hangout kind of t-shirt, but if you're going out and you want everything to look nice and smooth, I always go with bodysuits, so I love all the bodysuits that I got. Very, very, very pleased. But um, that is it, you guys. I hope you have enjoyed this try on haul. It's a little bit different from what I usually do. If you guys do like it, please let me know below. Please let me know all your thoughts below. I want to know what you think I did wrong, what you think I should do better, what you think I should do whatever, like if I should just completely do something different. I really love lookbooks too when it's just like music and just me describing. I like that too. But I feel like the try on haul is a little bit more personable. It's a little bit more like I get to you know, I literally tell you exactly how I feel, like how I have it on. So it's not like a voiceover where I have to like remember how it felt. I have it on and you know, this is what it feels like and here I am and it's comfortable and my no bra, but like you know what I mean? It's like a little bit more personable. It's a little bit more like I'm in the dressing room and you're just helping me find an outfit basically. So I feel like I really like that part of it. But let me know your thoughts below. You guys can check out Hot Miami Styles. Um, if you guys didn't see when I went to Vegas, I wore mostly Hot Miami Styles. And I actually, when I went away to LA and Vegas, I wore a lot of Hot Miami styles too because they're just, their outfits are super cute. They're not, ex they don't have to be extremely crazy either. Like they're not extremely naked, which I like too. But, you know, they do have those kind of outfits that if you do want to be a little naked, they have that. But they fit really, really nice. They're good, good quality. I really do recommend them. 
Um, so I would definitely go check them out. Let me know your thoughts, guys. I'm really, really interested to see and hear what you guys have to say. So I love you guys so much, and don't forget to thumbs up this video if you like the way it came out and you enjoyed trying on clothes with me. And if you are not subscribed yet, please do subscribe to my channel. And yeah, you'll be seeing more of my face if you do. So I love you guys so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye.